Well, we've arrived at the bend. There it is. We can see the river, but we don't actually know what the sites look like yet. So we're gonna go check it out. Let's go have a look. Big Bend Campground is approximately two hours from Adelaide CBD, around about 180 kilometers. Now the drive-in can be a little bit deceiving. It is Old Loxton Road, but it's only signposted on the opposite side. Big Bend is a basic camp. There are no bins or water, no amenities. It's just come as you are and take your rubbish with you. Yep, that's right, no toilets or showers. If you want to stock up on supplies, there's Swan Reach, which is about 10 minutes away, or Nil Doti, and there's a general store there as well. And once you've hit Riverside Drive, just keep watch as you see a grate coming up. Now, for some reason, I'm not sure why, there's only a 2.6 meter clearance here. So before you come here, make sure you're not wider than that. Otherwise you won't get in. Now while you're driving, watch out for cows. They do graze across here. You can pick up wood off the ground and have a fire here. My suggestion is bring your own fire pit. And welcome to Big Ben Campground. Let's focus on the right side of the strip. There are no marked sites here, but as you can see from previous campers, there are clearly defined sites that you can choose, but you pretty much can set up wherever you want. You can really see just how close you are to the river. Absolutely stunning. And it is riverside camping at its best. Even though there's beautiful spots along here, it is a bit more open than the other side of the strip. Now let's cross over to the other side of the strip and have a look from above. Amongst this beautiful scenery, we surprisingly saw the Proud Mary peacefully go by. Oh yes, and let's not forget the boat ramp. So if you've got your own boat, you can launch from here. Now, let's go look at the sights on the right hand side in a little bit of detail. In all the sites here, you'll be able to find a flat spot to set up. Like I mentioned previously, there's no marked sites here and you can set up pretty much anywhere, but we have marked as best as we can the sites that we think uh, are actually sites.
The side at the end has a bit of an angle, but at the very top it's flat. But you can also set up a swag down the bottom there and be quite level. It's time to check out the sights at the left side of the strip in more detail. It's interesting, you certainly have a sense of more privacy on, on this side. And one thing that's common across all the sites at Big Bend is everyone has river side access. One thing you will notice are these slip roads. There's quite a few of them along here to get you from the main dirt road to the site you're actually going to. If you haven't noticed already, the sites here are quite large. Before we show you our site, take note that one path is quite rutted, so go the other way.
and say hello to Jared, the Camp By Me caravan, and our wonderful Camp By Me patrol. And what a surprising experience we've had here at the bend just out of Swan Reach. This campground is amazing. Look at this river, look where we are. Unfortunately, there are some campers that we found that have left in, and left it in a, a bit of an undesirable state. So be prepared just to pick up some rubbish. Outside of that, this is free. This is wonderful. Come here and camp here. And remember, camp by me and you'll be a happy camper. After them, unfortunately, ah, uh, blah, blah, blah.